I am, oddly enough, a Care Bears fan. And by the way, I was still not lying. And guess what? Tenderheart loves you. Hello everybody, I'm just basically the kid that reviews stuff, and this is the long-awaited Care Bro vi video review. I also like to point out that it has been about a year since it has been uploaded, so I figured now is due time to give it a, a proper review that it deserves. So, I'm not going to waste any time. This is Kid Reviews, the Care Bro video. Hello everybody, Scratch Records Wyoming here, just a little quick of an update video. Oh yeah, I feel like I forgot to mention that originally when I did upload this, this was originally just supposed to be a regular update video, but instead I decided on my own terms that instead of just an update, why not also add in a confession? But, um, this is a different kind of video. Different is right. I actually had more hair back then. If you go to my about page on YouTube, Okay, I don't care if it's too early to mention this, but subscribe! Subscribe! Please subscribe! You'll notice that, yes, I do like Sonic the Hedgehog. Um, that's, uh, it's quite a stretch. Uh, funny how I was a Sonic fan, and now all of a sudden I'm now currently a Care Bears fan, and... Is it too late to back out of this review yet? I never really advertised it too much. I did have plans of making a web show, if you will. Yeah, I'm going to skip this part a little bit because it's never even going to happen anyways. If you guys keep going as you keep reading on my about page, you will notice that I have specifically put, I am, oddly enough, a Care Bears fan. Look at the cringe on his face. Look at the fact that he really doesn't want to give a shit about doing this, but instead does it anyways. Now, now I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. What the fuck is a kid at my age? Because I'm, I'm 16. Now currently 17. What the fuck is a kid at my age into Care Bears all of a sudden? And I've been a fan for the past six months. Funny, as of currently of the of the release of this video, it has actually been over 16 months since I've been a Care Bears fan. And believe me, it's not gonna go away. Now, again, I know what you're thinking. Okay, then, if you know what our thoughts are, then why in the hell is no one claimed Illuminati confirmed on you yet? Well, I won't be explaining much, but... I'm gonna save you these sloppy details as well. Basically... The nostalgia critic got me into it thanks to constant YouTube freaking recommendations coming up. A lot of them was basically strictly with just the Care Bears movie review. I figured, fuck it, I might as well watch it because it really started bugging the fuck out of me. I watched it a few times and I realized, YOLO, why not watch the movie? Watch the movie and then something I, I felt something I never really felt before. And then I started getting invested in a little bit more of this stuff, and then at this point now, then this is where I am today. I know it seems really odd talking about a topic like this in a serious type manner. Yeah, that right. He is also of what is considered a care bro. He, as in black nerd comedy. What is a care bro? An equivalent to a brony, except except someone who likes care bears as opposed to my little pony. No! This is the inner Care Bro me coming up, but no. We do not mention Care Bears and My Little Pony in the same room. It doesn't happen. It will never work that way. Believe me, you mention those two franchises in the same room, a lot of controversy is going to start, fights are going to happen, and you're going to really wish that you regretted saying anything regarding those two franchises. Just talking isn't enough. Oh no, you want more evidence. I'm going to give you more evidence. Whatever you do, make sure that it's clean. Um. Care bros are a thing. I, I know it. Why, why would I lie to you? Being a fan of Care Bears, I know it's hard to talk about this in a serious manner, but I'm going to try to keep it as serious as possible. After showing Tenderheart, no. No. There's no way in hell the rest of this video is going to be taken seriously. Trust me. It's a trend. 
And it sure in the hell is not a fetish. Seriously, I fucked up when I said that. I didn't know what it meant at the time. I don't know what it is, and I fucked up. It's not a fetish! I've been into this for six months. I like the candles. So much so that there, I have created a second channel based on anything Care Bears. It is what is considered as the Care Bear Critic. I will have a link in the, the description. Check out the channel. Even though, well, there's nothing on it, but there will be soon. Anything that I said when it came to reviewing anything Care Bear stuff will be on that channel only. It will not be classified as kid reviews, but instead known as the Care Bear Critic. So, why the fuck not? It's just that I kind of regretted doing this video because of the fact that, well, I might get a lot of hate towards me because I'm liking something that's not aiming for kid from someone at my age. And which is actually a good thing. I actually didn't really get much hate than I expected. I guess, I guess we do live in a world out there that actually gives a fuck. That actually cares. Thank God. But it deserves a fan base too. And since it deserves a fan base, I might as well be one of the very few YouTubers that's going to exploit the Carebro fandom. Why the fuck not? If you want. Let's not do what I said I was going to do because it really, no one said anything about it, so screw it. To sum the rest of this up, the Carebro video was honestly something that I kind of felt glad I did, at least looking back at it now in which that it's great to actually have something like this out there, at least have something known about it instead of just hiding in the shadows and locked up in a fucking suitcase or something. But the point of all of this is to at least acknowledge that there are people that are avid fans of the Care Bears. I am one of those people, and I am not afraid to, to actually say it and let it out. I'm not afraid. So for all those haters out there, you can suck my ass. I am an avid Care Bears fan. I am proud of it. I don't give a fuck what's said. Hate me all you want, but you know what? I think someone needs a Care Bear stand. <laughs> Anyways, I want to thank you guys for checking out the video. Like I said, the Care Bear Critic, which is the new YouTube channel based on anything Care Bears related when it comes to reviewing stuff, will be a link in the description. This video will be on a regular Scratch Your Records YNA channel, in which I almost forgot. Don't forget to check out the videos on there as well. I recently just uploaded a redo of, coincidentally, the Care Bro video's YouTube poop I originally did. I redid it, and I did it in Final Cut, as I am doing with this project that I will be doing for future projects. And actually, it turned out pretty hilarious. And believe it or not, Due to editing that I've been doing with the redo of this YouTube poop, that is where I honestly got the. I decided that I'm going to do a second YouTube channel that is going to strictly solely be based on reviews of anything Care Bear stuff. Now, this could mean anything. This could mean the toys. This could mean the movies. This could be the TV show. It could be anything. I don't care what it is. It's all going to be done, and it's just going to happen. So this copyright strike crap that's on this channel, unfortunately, I'm, that's going to have to go. And then after that, I'm probably going to start looking at the late night Let's Plays again. I really want to get back into doing it. Hopefully, I actually have some stuff planned. I'm, pro I'm planning on doing it. I want to get back into it. I'm probably going to start doing some stuff in advance and then uploading it at a later date, at least after the strike. The reason, and for those who do check out the Late Night Let's Play videos, specifically the Dark Stone ones, I did take down the seven videos because I am collaborating all seven into one, and based on the project, I cut it a little bit, you know, just cut some, like, outro stuff or whatever to make it kind of feel like long running. It's at least two and a half hours long. And I can't put it up on the channel yet because, again, of the copyright strike. So that video will be up as soon as this strike is gone. 
Then I can finally start making these fuckers long, baby. So long. <laughs> All right. I want to thank you guys for checking out the channel. Again, Camera Critic channel. That will be a link in the description. Don't forget to subscribe in advance if you want. I'm not asking you to, but if you want, subscribe in advance because there is some good stuff that's coming out. Now, I know what I said a while back that originally I was going to be doing the first Care Bears movie as a review. I'm not going to do that because I don't want to feel like I'm repeating shit or whatever. I want to at least try to make it as original as possible. And since that there is some Care Bears movies that no online critic has done yet, I figured I'm going to be the first to do so. So tune in because it's going to be a laughing time. It's going to be funny. It's going to be awful. It's going to be ecstatically cringeworthy enough to where you might click off this video as soon as it starts. Or at least after the ad. I'm the kid that reviews stuff and... Care Bear Stare.